All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Mafia 2. We got abruptly woken up by Joe and his idiot friend down there. So let's get out of here. What is this? Is this just a pantry? This is a bathroom. And dressed we go. Out we go. Let's go see what they want. I think his name was Marty. He seemed pretty excited, but he always seems pretty excited. Who the hell was that? Guy's got a voice like Woody fucking Woodpecker. That was Marty. Remember the little kid you slipped down the street from me? I had to pick up the truck here, so he gave me a lift. What's going on with the truck? It's gonna make us some nice cash. Hop in. I'll explain on the way. You drive. Where to? Riverside. All right, Riverside it is. All right, sounds good. Some uh, nice. Don't huh? damage the yeah, kids. You could say that. Why? You ain't still mad, are you? Nah, carrying a stiff. That's the first thing I wanted to do when I got out. Hey, come on. You had fun at the cat house, right? Yeah, yeah, I did. Thank you for that. But, uh, everything between then and now, not so much. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, listen, today's gonna be a lot better, I promise. I sure as hell hope so. I mean, that's not something you really want to be doing when you just got out of prison. <laughs> Especially if it's a welcome home party. Simple. We just gotta go to a couple of places and unload these smokes. Then we bring the truck back to Eddie and get our cutter to take. Piece oh. of cake. Wait a minute. You seem to remember getting thrown in the clink for a piece of cake just like this. Don't worry. I've done this before. First stop, Riverside. If you say so. Trust me. You're gonna thank me later. All right. We'll see. Next thing you know, Vito and Joe are both in prison. <laughs> but the, the game wouldn't pull that. I don't think any developer would do that to someone. Like, holy shit, get Shawshank twice. Okay, whoa. Stay in your lane there, buddy. At some point, I do need to stop up with Giuseppe's. Um, do we turn and hit? No, around the corner. What now? Now we take care of our customers. These guys here buy in bulk from us. Come with me. Okay, climb up and hand me the goods. All right, Hi, one carton of reds. Reds. Hand me a cotton of reds, Vito. Yeah, that's the one. Yeet. What do you want? Here it is. Hey, good to see you. I'm all out of smokes. Give me a cotton of blues. One cotton of blues, Vito. I think this is it. It's kind of hard to tell. Oh, yeah. Bingo. With the way the lighting is. Here it is. A few hours later. Jesus, that's a long time. What the fuck? 
Hey, Sarge, how you doing? Caught in the blues, as usual? I think I'll take the whites this time. All right. Yeah, that Vito. Let's go. Caught in the whites. Yeah, that's the one. Thanks, Joe. Now get the hell out of here, will you? Okay, time to go. Get in, Vito. Next stop is Millville. All right. It's going great today. We're making some serious dough here. Even got cops as customers. All right. I mean, there's one operation you can be sure they won't be trying to crack down on. <laughs> oh, shit. So, the kid Mark, he works for Eddie, too? <laughs> In his dreams. Kid's not even 18 yet. He does jobs for me, drives me around, makes deliveries, that sort of stuff. Thinks he's a gangster, though. Spends too much damn time at the movies. Well, the <laughs> kid's got you for a role model. He's in for a lot of trouble. Oh, yeah, wise guy? He reminds me a lot of you when you was his age. Exactly. And I spent two years dodging bullets in Europe and six years in the can since I met you. That's what I mean by trouble. What's the matter? Somebody shit in your coffee this morning? It's like you forgot about all the good times. Yeah, remind me of those someday, would you? Yeah, somebody did shit in his coffee. <laughs> That's one hell of an expression, bro. Like, sure, it would make you mad, but who the fuck would drink that? You know, I'm real glad that we don't have to see advertisements on freeways anymore. Like, you, you'll get the occasional billboard and that's it. And most of those are torn to shit and forgotten about. But barrier ads would be the bane of my existence. Oh, no, 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 no. Overshot it, overshot it, overshot it. Oh, I can keep going. Yeah, that's right. We gotta spend 10 years trying to get up past 40. See, what did I tell you? It's going like butter today. All right, this almost makes up for last night. Almost. Come on, what's better than this? You got fresh air, good company, and you're making a shitload of dough. Not too bad for a guy who just got out of the slam. All right, all right, listen. The next few hours or anything like the last few hours, all's forgiven. There's the veto I know. All right, we'll be there in a sec. Now all we gotta do is find an off ramp. Taking me all the way around town. Oh my god. It is. I should have just turned around when I had the chance. Honking frustration. Where does this bridge end? There we go, God. Thought I was just driving into the infinite abyss.
Hey, you just went through a red light. Yeah, nobody cares about that, Joe. It's the speeding they care about. Maybe not. I think we went way far. Of course. Oh, it's right up there. Good. If you please, give me a cotton of blues. All right, bingo. There you go. Here it is. Hi, I'll take a box of reds. All right, cotton of reds, Vito. All right, and it over. Anybody else? Here it is. What you selling, Mac? You buying or just window shopping? Maybe. We're selling smokes. Two bucks a carton, hundred bucks a crate. I'll make you a deal. You fuck over ten cartons, and maybe we'll let you and your buddy get out of here in one piece. Hey, look, pal. How about you get back in your cute little car with your little friends there, and I'll pretend I never seen you. Sound good? <laughs> you don't get it, do you, you fat motherfucker? This is our turf, and it's gonna cost you to operate here. Now pay up. You're the one who doesn't get it. You have any idea who you're talking to? One last chance. You walk away now, and... Yeah, I'll tell you who I'm talking to. A fat two-bit fucking Dago door-to-door -door salesman hocking stolen cigarettes on my turf. And it's time to close up shop, asshole. Okay, boys. I think it's time for a fire sale. Shit. Yo! Ooh. Fuck. <laughs> what do you say now? What do I gotta say? That's what I gotta say. Come on. Hop in that car and let's go. All right. Oh, let's shit. Get one of these okay. fucks and teach him a lesson. Catch the greasers. Step on it, Vito. He's getting away. I got it floored, Joe. This thing won't go any faster. Yeah, he's uh, blowing us out of the water over there. Yeah, he's gone. He's fucking gone. Ah, shit. Now what? Shit, we should check in with Eddie. Stop at the nearest phone booth and call him. Alright. Uh, where is... They're not on the map. Okay. So we'll just get off on the... Off the freeway and, uh... See if we can find one. Oh boy. What's up your ass today? Is there a payphone around here? Right up here. Eddie, 
It's me, Vito. Listen, we got a problem. We were moving the smokes, and then these, uh, these greases came out of nowhere and set the fucking truck on fire. What? You fucking kidding me? You couldn't handle a bunch of grease balls? What the fuck happened? Look, look, Eddie, Eddie, hey, listen, it's not our fault, okay? They set the fucking truck on fire before we knew what was happening, and everything burned up. All right, we popped one of the guys, but... What do I fucking care? Just bring me my money. I paid two grand for that truck, and I want it back. Lucky for you two retards, I got Derek's guy Steve here with me. And we were just talking about what to do with those punks. We're gonna take care of them now. Steve will meet you at the Crazy Horse. You know it? Okay. Crazy Horse, yeah, I know where it is. Steve's gonna have a few guys with him. Show them that nobody fucks with us. No shooting, though. So it looks like just another gang fight. I don't want to read about a bloodbath in the papers tomorrow. All right, sure, Eddie. Don't worry. We'll take care of it. All right. We're going to Crazy right, Horse, Joe. We gotta meet Joe. Steve in front of that Crazy Horse. Good news is he's gonna help us out. Bad news is Eddie wants his money back. All two grand of it. Shit! You really think we're gonna get two G's out of these guys? I don't know. We'll see what Steve's got in mind. You know he ain't doing this out of the kindness of his heart. Let's go. Does anybody really do any of this out of the kindness of their heart? Ah, oh, Eddie was fucking pissed on the phone. Sure he was. Just like I'm pissed right now. Even if these assholes ain't got a dime, I'm gonna kick $2,000 worth of shit out of him. I'm with you. But what's Steve doing working for Eddie? He works for Derek, and Derek's with Vinci's crew. How the hell should I know? But hey, you're still gonna take jobs from Derek, right? Even though you're working for Eddie? We all gotta do what we gotta do to get by. I mean, sure. Slow the fuck down before you get pulled over. Take it easy, I'm in a rush. Hey, Steve. Hey. Hey, guys. Marty? What are you doing here? Hey, Joe. I'm going with you on this one. Steve needed help. He said I could come along. Steve, uh, isn't this, yeah. uh... Kids gotta learn sometime. Okay, why are we here, Steve, huh? The guys we're looking for are all headed to the foundry. This is where they usually meet, so we'll start here, then head over to the foundry to finish the job. And, uh, why'd you volunteer to help us? Those bastards trashed my cousin's car. They robbed him and knocked out three of his teeth. Yeah, those fucking assholes. They make problems all over the city. What'd you Shut up, kid. I'm talking here. So, like the Bible says, an eye for an eye, tooth for a tooth. And, well, we'll just start with this joint. So what's the plan? First, we're gonna trash this place. And how are we gonna do that? With this. Go ahead, boys. Hey, come on, guys. <laughs> now you can either help us or stay out of our way. <laughs> Let's go teach these fuckers a lesson. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> this is a laugh. Really fun for them, huh? Okay, that's enough. Let's leave him a little crisp. Vito, Marty, I got some Molotov cocktails in the trunk. Go get them and throw them in. <laughs> My pleasure, Steve. Foundry. Get in, boys. We'll meet you two at the main gate. See you there. Come on, Joe. See how this turns out. Marty, Marty definitely ain't ready for this shit. Not because of his age, but the way he's acting. <laughs> I'll 
think he fully understands he can get killed. How'd you get in here? Followed the fucking yellow brick road. <laughs> Next. Ha, <laughs> nice one. You fuckers are dead. Joe, watch out! <sighs> Thanks, kid. Shit, they got guns! Let them have it! Alright. Going in! Gentle, Shit. Okay, he's just going in hard on it. Try and get around behind it. Go around behind it. Scared asshole. Scared asshole. Wait, can I, uh, yes. Try not to die. Kill the fight. Shit. Way to go, Vito! Shit, let's go! Cover! I amaze myself! God damn it, really? Hey, everything alright over there? Where's the last one? Let's go! Catch up! I nicked him. I don't think I got him. Somebody else is still alive. Where is he? anyone Just the scratch. 
There's no way I'm gonna be able to make that shot. Kiss your ass goodbye. They teach you the army? Come out of your hole, you fucking rat. Gun. Hello. I won't want to get on your bad side. Right. I saw a shotgun around here. There we go. Right, let's keep it semi auto. Poke him out in the middle of a gun. Hey!
Let's go, Vito. Close to. They just pushed somebody out in the. Oh no. Listen, this got way out of hand. Eddie's not gonna be too happy. Eddie'll be fine. What are we gonna do? Just let him kill us? These fucking dirtbags won't be bothering nobody. No more. What now, Steve? Now I'm gonna go home and see if that castor oil's working. I've been blocked up for weeks. I'll see you later. Joy, Joe and I still got a lot of work to do. We'll catch you later. Shit, where are we gonna get the two Gs for ready? You got any idea how much a car like this goes for? Damn, Vito, you're a genius. These babies ain't cheap, right? I bet Derek would give us at least a grand for that one. All right, I'm gonna drive this baby over to Derek's. I'll meet you back at the fountain. Sounds like All a plan. Right. I'll see you at the bar. Look at this, baby. Someone at the docks. Accelerates pretty fast. And it zooms. Almost two grand. Give Eddie his two thousand dollars. How much did Joe sell that the other car for? I need a, I need a car of my own. Cause you know we can split this debt for fuck's sake.
Walter Coop. More damage than I thought. Pretty sure he's dead. He's Falcon. Let's go talk to him. So? Is the money. Well, that's a fucking relief. Stupid fucking junkies. Now they know their place. Good work, boys. Here's your cat. Thanks, Eddie. So, you need anything else from us today, or is that it? I got something I gotta take care of. No, 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 that's all for today. I'll call you if I need anything. Sweet. Go home. Arrivederci. Ciao. This is not a phrase I like to hear. Go home. <laughs> All right. Uh, body shop. You know what? Since we're here, stop by Giuseppe. I've been meaning to do that. Just waste a little bit of time and that's really it. I can just still go home. I got. All right, he's got Molotovs, a Magnum. Make sure you light before you throw. Is that all you need? Will there be anything else? All right, that's it. That's all I wanted. If you need anything else, you come back. I take care of it. It's always good to keep, uh, you know, munitions under control. In full supply. Oh my god.
it just I wasn't even close to hitting him and he just pops over the fence. Let's get Vito to bed. Oh, this is the wrong door. It's all the way at the top, if I remember right. Well, let's take a look around. It, okay, so it's basically just a studio apartment. I mean, that's fine. If you're one person, you don't really uh, need all that. No good for a family, though, but, you know, still. Again, six twin beds. Let's see who wants what. Wait, where's the phone? Can I? Hello? Yeah, Vito, we got a situation here. Grab a gun and meet me at the bar. And make sure you're driving a decent set of wheels. All right, I'll be right there. There goes my Sunday. <laughs> okay. Well, let's get dressed. And off we go. This is the police. Open up. Uh, glad you're not here for me. I ask you some questions. Is that the same woman? If you okay. Open the door, we're gonna open it up for you. Oh, that that car is still sitting there. All right, he said decent set of wheels, so. something in here that was real fast that's very fast which I should probably customize uh, top feed 137 13 let's get this one just cuz okay when we return in a moment ladies and gentlemen citizens of the empire we're gonna see what's up at the bar so i thank you so much for watching if you're on youtube please like comment subscribe on twitch drop me a follow if you haven't already and i'll be back in a moment mm -hmm.